and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about my sock leggings and which one I have in my collection and which, which ones are my favorites. And I have sock leggings from three different brands. I have two pairs from Bombshell. These ones is the high thighs and ones is the shorter sock leggings. I have one pair from abs to be fitness and I have two pairs from D Tina. So I'm going to try them on and show you guys and I'm going to tell you which ones are my favorite in the end of this video. I'm going to show them by brand. So let's start with the one from D Tina. Both of them are like the same type of sock leggings and uh, I did customize both of them on their website. The first one is with a pink and then it's like mesh in the middle part and then black sock like that. I can say that I am not a big fan of these ones. I like that they are high in the waist and it's scrunchy booty in the back. But what I don't like is that they totally screwed up when it comes to the stitching here because they have done something with the stitching that makes the like seams here dig into my thighs. I don't know if you can see that in the picture but it's not very comfortable. These pink ones are also very big in the waistband. I don't know why because these are in small. Every single leggings that I'm going to show you is in size small, if I forget to tell you. They are in size small, but this fabric in the pink, they are not like, I don't know, it's just going down and moving around and it's not like tight enough, but yet it's, I don't know, it's just the slippering around. So I don't like these ones and I am honestly not going to keep these ones. I have never used them in the gym because they do not feel comfortable. So I guess you know already this is not my favorite. These ones are... The same problem, but I do like the fabric on these ones more, so I am going to keep these ones and I will see if I am going to use them or not. I still haven't used them in the gym, but I don't like that they are also digging in, so it's the same problem with this one. They do have to redo the formula when they are doing like the seams here, because they are not comfortable. Other than that, I do really like the colors on these ones, and I do really love this, like, when I look at them like this, I love them. but. When I put them on, they are not very comfortable. They also have the scrunchiness in the back. So these are not my favorite ones, but I am going to keep these ones. I guess you know already that the Tinas is not going to be my favorite brand. So it's between the abs to be and the Bombshell Sportswear. But let's talk about the abs to be tights. Because they are a little bit like the DT Nas when it comes to the scrunchiness and the upper area. They are very high in the waist and I do really love them. These have the white parts underneath and I do really like the details that they have like the grey seams in the end there and uh, these are like the higher thighs model and uh, <clears throat> I don't have any problem with the seams here so the seam is very stretchy yeah overall these are very comfortable they are squat proof and I like them so the last pairs are the two ones from Bombshell Sportswear and something I can say I, oh, I forgot to tell you, the DTNAS, these ones retail for $65, the one from abs to be retailed for $65, and the Bombshell Sportswear are $86 a piece, so they are very pricey, but something I can say about them is that their fabric is something different. I mean, Bombshell Sportswear have something like very soft in their fabric, and that is why I have to say that Bombshell Sportswear, even though I hate the price tag, but I have to say that these are my favorite sock leggings. And I think that they were more or less the original one coming out with the sock leggings. I might be wrong, but that is just, it was the first ones I saw having the sock leggings. And out of the two of them, the ones that are my favorites is the one with the high thighs. They have like this very soft fabric here. And the waistband is the perfect waistband, it's not digging in, but it's keeping the pants up. And then it's like another fabric, like a real sock fabric in the sock parts with the stripes. So I do really love these ones and I can say that even though I paid a hell of a lot of money for them, I still think that in one way they are worth the money, in one way not. They don't give me any support or anything. But still, they are super comfortable, super, super comfortable. So these are my favorites out of all of them. But I do also love my other pair of leggings from Bombshell Sportswear. And these are the original ones that came out that the socks are not like up to the thighs. It's shorter socks. It's the same kind of material in the socks part and it also comes with the stripes. 
The material in the actual pants is different from these ones. It's a little bit thicker, but still it's this very soft, soft material. Same with the waistband. The waistband is thick and nice, but it's not digging in too much and they stay up. So I really love the Bombshell Sportswear. I don't understand why the price tag is so high, but um, if it wasn't for the price tag, I would buy all the colors of these ones. But I don't want to pay $86 for every single piece. That is why I just have them in two colors, but I would love to have them in more colors. And maybe in the future I will buy more of them. So out of all of these ones, the Bombshell Sportswear is the winner, but I have to say second place is the abs to be. I have seen now that they are coming out with socks leggings that have like stripes and things and maybe that's a little more fun. These are very plain, but um, the material is very nice in the abs to be ones, but my favorite and the winners are the Bombshell Sportswear. So I hope that you guys found this video helpful if you want to buy a pair of sock leggings. Another thing I can say is that DTNAS and abs to be always have coupon codes. If you go to their Instagram, you can find coupons. So the price tags on those are a little less than $65 also. So when it comes to the price, I would say the Bombshell Sportswear are ridiculously pricey. But I do really love them anyhow. So I hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, I would love you to subscribe to my channel and be part of my YouTube family here. And I just hope I see you guys in my next coming video. Bye!